Hey guys, welcome to my channel. And today I have a collective message. We're going to find out what's going on through the here. Please remember this minute right now for everyone. So let's get straight into this and find out what we're wanting you to know. Okay, so whoever I'm speaking to, you have somebody here that it feels like they don't want anyone else but you. Um, this person, now for some of you, you may actually be in a relationship with this person, but if you're not, this is somebody that is actually very serious about you. I just seen one, one, one. This person is completely serious about you. If you guys are not together yet, this person is kind of... They have their eyes set on you. Like, they have their heart set on you, right? They definitely... This is somebody that... They also seem to be very spiritually aware. Um, this is somebody that also may be very physically attractive. And I just need one for one. Let me know if that resonates. This person may actually be physically attractive. Um, there's an energy of... At the moment, they may be kind of... There could be some type of temptation, okay? Somebody may be trying to tempt them. Um, and again, this could be somebody that you're in a relationship with. Or if it's not, it's somebody that is set on being with you, right? This is somebody that feels a very strong connection to you to the point where, and I just need two, 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 to the point where 3D connections don't seem to, they don't bother this person. This person isn't tempted by other people. Um, there's this energy of... For some of you, you may actually be single, but this person, like, they may be single as well, but they still want to be with you. It's like they're only attracted to you. I do see this person really holding on to you. And again, this is somebody that you may be in a relationship with. If not, this person feels like you're literally there happily ever after. It just feels like ever since meeting this person... They really value you. They really feel appreciative um, to be in your life, right? This person really understands your value as well, right? They also understand that nobody compares to you, right? Especially to them. Like, nobody compares to you. You seem to be... They really have put you on a pedestal, okay? They look at you different to other people because this person has a lot of love for you. This person, for some of you, is actually in love with you. And again, um, I do see people throwing themselves at this person, but this person's not interested. This person has their sights set on you. They're holding on to you. Um... I do think somebody trying to get, and I just think 414, I do think somebody trying to get in the middle of this, right? Whoever this is, they're really trying to get your person's attention. I do think this person kind of wanting to come in between you two, especially if you guys are already dating. But even if you are not dating this person, whoever this is that's trying to come in between you, they know about you, right? And this person is trying to kind of come in between the connection. I do see this person throwing themselves at your person. Um, for some of them, they want your person to choose them. 
you could be dealing with a Leo, you could be dealing with a Capricorn. Okay, so you may not even know that this is going on for some of you. Somebody is kind of competing with you, right? Even though the position, okay, it's not something that can be competed for. Like, this is something that you own, right? You own this person's heart. This is something that... You know, this person that's trying to come in between this connection, they cannot come in between it because this person, they have such a strong love for you. And again, it's like your person, they don't have eyes for anyone but you. And again, there may be people trying to come in and tempt them. But I do see that in the past, this person may have made the mistake of maybe giving into temptation this person knows deep down that nobody makes them feel the way that you do okay nobody is you I keep hearing nobody is you and this person they really cherish you they value you this person loves everything about you I'm hearing facial expression, so this person may actually really like your facial expression when you speak, um, but I'm just getting that they love everything about you. And this is somebody that really doesn't want to mess up their opportunity with you. So even if you guys are not together yet, like I do see this person not being interested in anyone but you because they don't want to miss the opportunity. They don't want to ruin it, right? Whoever this is, there's this very strong protective energy that they have for you. Like this is somebody that they feel like it's their mission in life to protect you. Um, this is somebody that doesn't want to see you hurt. They don't want to do anything to hurt you. They really just want to, and again, even if you're not with this person yet, this is something that this person knows, okay? They want to protect you. They want to protect your heart. You've really, whoever this is, you've really opened up this person's heart. I do see that you've helped them change for the better. You've really helped them open up their eyes. In the past, they may have made some mistakes okay but this person they've grown a lot because of this connection and you and again even if this is not a relationship yet this will be a relationship I do see a whole lot of new beginning energy here but I do see that this may already be a relationship and you have really helped change this person into a better person right you could be dealing with a cancer, strong cancer energy. I do see this person, there's this energy of, they feel like, now even if this is somebody that's not with you, right, this person feels like they need to be with you because they feel like that they will treat you right. Now this person's scared, especially if you guys are not together, like they're scared that, if you are with anyone else or if you do meet somebody else that whoever you're with won't treat you right like this person has a fear that if they're not with you they won't be able to protect you and they won't they can't keep you safe I'm hearing right so if this is somebody that you're already in a relationship with this is somebody that never wants to lose you they just really want to keep you safe um protect you right and if this is somebody that you're not in a relationship with yet this is just somebody that they know that they're determined to be with you so they could look after you they also have a major fear that you are going to settle for less or you're going to settle for somebody that doesn't recognize your worth because this person they really value you and i'm hearing veronica let me know if that resonates they really value you and they 
they really fear the light in you. They really fear. Now, this person, whoever they are, they see past any, like, your looks. They see past all of that. This person loves you for who you are deep down, like, to the core. Like, this person loves every bit of you, okay? They also, they're very in love with your mind, okay? They feel like you're very intelligent. They feel like you guys have amazing conversations. You guys connect really well. I'm hearing precious. Maybe they call you precious. Um, or they just feel like you're very precious, right? Whoever this is, so this person, wow, whoever this is, they are very protective, like, I mean, overprotective to the point where they really analyze you. Whoever this is, they really analyze you. Um, they also feel like the people... Especially that a friend, okay? There's a friend that they do not like. They feel like this friend is not good for you at all. They feel like this friend is fake. They feel like this friend kind of maybe wants to even hurt you. There may be something that this friend is hiding, okay? For some of you, um... If you're not with this person currently, and you're seeing somebody else, they also don't like the person that you're seeing. They feel like you can't trust the person that you're seeing, okay? And this person feels like they know, they may know something, or they're just really good at reading people. There could be, um... For some of you, they could be a friend and a partner or an ex, okay, that maybe went behind your back. There seems to be something hidden here, right? This person feels like... For some of you, if you're not with this person... They feel like you're settling for second best, um, you deserve better. For others, they may have helped you out of a situation where people were betraying you, people were hurting you, right? Like, I'm getting that you may have been in a relationship with, say, an ex, okay, and the ex was, like, hurting you, cheating on you. There may have also been a friend involved, right? But I do, yeah, wow, I don't know what this means, but I do think that whoever I'm speaking to, you've been through some betrayal. You've dealt with somebody that, and you may currently still be dealing with this person, but you've dealt with somebody that has betrayed you big time, hurt you, lied to you, right? Yeah, so I am getting that you have already walked away or you're about to walk away. There's this betrayal now. For some of you, if you don't know about this, okay, you're about to find out about this. There's a betrayal, right? Some two people it looked like betrayed you. Two people that were very close to you betrayed you, and it's coming out. Or it's already came out and I do think you're walking away from the situation. You may have met this other person here that really wants to protect you and look after you. And I just need one four four four. You may have met them when you were in this toxic situation where people were hurting you and betraying you and kind of stepping all over you, okay? Um 
I do see you walking away from this situation of betrayal, you taking your power back. Um, I do see you really working on yourself and you realizing just how important and how special you are, right? How powerful you are, right? I do see you in the past giving your power up to people that were lying and hurting you. But I do see that this new person here, they really, they've been waiting for you, I'm getting, right? They really want to, this is somebody that wants to spend their life with you. This is somebody that, they may have tried to get over you or forget about you, but this person, I just seen 1551, this person feels like it's impossible to forget about you. They feel like they're supposed to protect you. There's this energy where this person really feels like, they're supposed to protect you, and this person is protecting you behind the scenes. This could even be them spiritually protecting you, right? This person always makes sure that you're safe. This person always keeps an eye on you. If you guys are not together, like, this person's always watching you. But if this, you guys are together, like, this is somebody that just wants to keep you safe, protect you, right? This is also somebody that will move mountains just to be with you, right? And just to make you happy. You could be dealing with a Capricorn. Strong Capricorn in this reading. You could be dealing with a Taurus or a Leo. So basically this is somebody that seen you go through some type of toxic relationship or situation, they've seen people take you for granted and this was somebody that, I don't know, it's like they made this promise to themselves that they were going to protect you but for some of you I am getting that this protection thing, this determination to protect you is actually something that stems from a past life, right? You guys could have made a promise to each other in a past life um, and this person, they may not remember that or anything, but it's just like when they met you, they just had this strong urge to protect you, to look after you. So I do see that for some of you, you may have just got out of a toxic relationship, a situation where people were betraying you, hurting you, keeping things from you. I do see this person, they've been waiting for you. It's like they've been watching you. They feel a very strong soul connection to you. They may have been waiting for you to end something. Um, for some of you, they have been kind of waiting for you to recognize your worth because I do see that you were settling for less right this is somebody that has been waiting for you this is somebody as well if you think that this person has been like maybe they had other options or they've been seeing other people no this person hasn't other people have been like trying to like pursue them this person's whole focus is you like i mean i see this person so what I'm picturing in my head is like one person and behind them is like a group of people that are trying to get their attention, but they're just focused on you, right? And that's what I'm getting. It's like, okay, people may have tried to get this person's attention. This person, nobody has ever made them feel the way that you make them feel. And even if like, you know, you guys haven't had such a deep connection in the 3D in this lifetime, this is something that you guys have had past lives together, okay? You guys have a very strong soul connection. There's something about you. You're this person's weakness. And it's like this person, whoever this is, they never ever believed in like love or anything like that. Like this person, when they met you, they started to believe in soul connections, in true love, in love at first sight, right? Like, you really changed this person's perspective. 
this person before meeting you and feeling this connection, they may have been somebody that, you know, wanted to be a player, wanted to have options, okay, this person, you completely changed their mind, now this person, they have all eyes set on you, like, you've really opened this person up to the meaning of true love, right, and the feeling of really wanting to just look after somebody and protect somebody, For some of you, um, again, this person, they don't see anyone but you, right? Nobody, this is somebody that is very, they kind of show everyone else apathy, that, that's what it is, because they don't have faith in their heart for anyone, like you own this person's heart. And this person, they're quite cold to everyone else, right? And I just seen 2112. This person's cold to everyone else, okay? This is somebody that actually may, if you guys are not together, they may have like casual connections with people and it's very meaningless to, to them. They also may, this is somebody that they kind of treat other people cold. They don't really care about other people. But the thing is, they, when it comes to you, they really care about you, right? Like, they just, there's something about them where they feel like they just need to look after you. They need to be with you. They need to work on themselves just, you know, to be with you, work on this connection. And again, for some of you, this is already a connection. But for others, I'm getting this in somebody that... They met you and you just changed their whole life. Like, and you may not have even realized it. You changed their, you changed, especially when it comes to love. Like before, I'm getting this person wasn't, they didn't really believe in like love stories or like they didn't really believe in true love. Like, I, it's like they thought that was like a fairy tale or something. But this connection here has really opened them up to the sort of, soul connection, okay, um, love at first sight, this person now knows what it means to be in love and kind of not be attracted to anyone else but you, like, I mean, of course they're still attracted to other people, but they're not tempted by other people because this person, this is somebody that their heart is with you, okay? this person's very aware of their feelings, okay, they're very aware that, you know, nobody could equal you, nobody could replace you, okay, so this person doesn't even try, they may have done that in the past, no, they don't even try, for some of you, this person's been waiting to be with you, they finally got the chance to be with you with this person, cherishing every moment, and thank God every day that they have a chance with you, right, so that's all I have for you guys, if it resonated, let me know, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next reading.